good afternoon guys Devin Burris here with power shine pressure washing we are getting a late start today the client said they weren't gonna be home until 2 o'clock getting a lot later start than I like to get but work is work and you can't complain I asked them if they wanted to push it off till tomorrow and they were like nope Tuesday's fine so here we are checking out some of the beautiful scenery here in South Georgia it's a beautiful day so I'll get with you whenever I get to the job all set up here on our wash for the day I got a hose 200 foot of hose pulled all the way there we're gonna wash our way around the front I'm gonna show you guys something that I'm dealing with on this job pretty common you see on nicer neighborhoods but SH will take the stains off as you saw on the one we did yesterday so we got this wooden ceiling here uh, same as the door there's wood here on the door and we just let them know we're gonna avoid that area altogether with chemicals I'm just gonna wash that with water so anywhere I can put chemicals I will but we're basically just gonna avoid these areas just to kind of limit the possibility of discoloration a loss of stain video we shot yesterday somebody had came and washed that lady's house that didn't cover anything absolutely stripped the stain off it's a beautiful day to wash it is currently 226 we're running right now we're about to get started i already pre-wet some of the vegetation in the back we're going to soak this area soak the front it's pretty straightforward as far as house washes go nothing real fancy i think the most difficult part will be these porches just with trying to get something clean but not using chemical now, there's a lot of bugs up here and we're going to take care of all of that crud all that cobwebs and pretty typical pretty typical stuff you see on most houses the little dog tried to bite my finger through the window there's some green this is the north side of the house so there's green all over here pretty straightforward i'm going to go ahead and get to soaping not sure how much footage i'm going to get on this job clients are walking around with me a little bit so they, they seem to be involved in the project pretty heavily so we're just gonna roll with the punches like I said I'm running I got hose pulled all the way around the back we're gonna wash back there first and then I'm gonna wash my way around probably take this about one side at a time uh, just really focus on getting this knocked out Leave me a like, subscribe, this is going to be short and sweet, little house wash today. We're going to start off with just water, try and wash off some of that wood in the back first. I'm just putting some water up here on this, I'm not going to go all the way up, I told the client I wasn't going, wasn't going to, just to kind of get some water on it beforehand, so any overspray that we might have doesn't actually do any damage that's the process guys just try and eliminate the risk we're pulling chemicals now I already rinsed down all the vegetation saw me pre-wet all the wood And with some of these jobs you're gonna have some overspray if you're at least doing something to slightly mitigate you'd be better off so we just did a light application there we're not gonna do any heavier than that I'm gonna soak the rest of this back and then I'll come back and I'll rinse it off really heavily and like I said to you before we're doing this one side at a time this house I'll follow up with you guys whenever I get to the front. This is going to be short and sweet today, guys.
So we got the whole front soaked and cleaned up, looking good. I tossed my gun down, and as you can see, it's absolutely spraying and making a mess, and it's from the inside of the gun. That gun's been really great. A lot of guys would be screwed right now, but I got a backup gun that was ready to go. So the old adage, two is one and one is none. I'm gonna swap this over and soap this side and then I'll be all finished. All done, all rolled up. This job came out really beautifully. Had that uh, gun pretty much explode on me while I was coming over here to switch over from chemicals to rinse. And that's why you always carry backup. I've been meaning to switch that one out for a little while now, but I just haven't gotten around to it. It's hot today. 348. Took us a little over an hour for that job. Like, subscribe to all the YouTube stuff, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.